anyway, what he was doing him. And I seen then, like, I got to get him. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because I've been taught better. Because Paco ran up and hugged him, Dad. And what he like, what's up, boo? I <laughs> <laughs> too. Wow. A regular hey, two-year-old would have ran to you. He been live. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. It was Parko, then Tori, then Wody. Wody. So when I left at 18, I was going to Sam Houston High School at the time. And uh, yeah, I went to the penitentiary for two years to come home. But by that time, <laughs> her family had already put the influence on Wody. You know what I mean? He like was, she come from the was type. Two. He was two. She come from the type family in the hood. Like that's she got the type family that you just you don't want to get tired of with. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be on the good side and you damn sure don't want to be on the bad side. <laughs> wow. You know? So it's like that. So, so it's her. Okay. Yeah. So, so <laughs> yeah. So you you feel I, me. I really you feel, feel you. Me. Like I get it. So <laughs> it it was like that. And so when I come home, you know, I mean, I I, my, I was raised, raised up pretty decently. My granny, she was a big influence on my life, you know, yeah. my work, everything, you know. My mom and my daddy, you know, they was there, but my granny, she was a she huge. She kept that money on your books. Yeah. Who? Your, your granny? No. No. She didn't keep no money on your books? Did no. she write you the letters? No. no. She she did the choice where it's either help you or help your kids. Yeah. Oh, okay. And that's how my mama that's was. That's, that's how dope. my mama was. So, like, my, my when I did that two years, I, I seen my mama, like, twice. Yeah. And because she, financially, she couldn't do it. And then, again, she was helping me. I got three kids on the streets. So, she helping, you know, them with the kids. What year was that? That was uh, from ninety nine to two thousand. What? 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 You? What, you? You went state? No, two thousand to two thousand. Well, well, I'll take yeah. yeah. I left in January two thousand one because I had already had three months. Uh, okay. Like time, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah they so, ran that yeah. with it. And and where did you go first? For the penitentiary. Yeah. Okay. The first I went to. Uh, Reed. No, no, no. No, no Middleton to go read. No, transfer I went to, I went to, No, I went to Middleton. Okay. I left Middleton. I went to Plainview. I got bench warning because I was on paper. Yeah. In Dallas already, when I got my time out of Tarrant County. So when I came back, I went through Hutchins. Then I left Hutchins, I went to... Yeah, they be doing that too. I think I went to, was it Darrington? No, what was the other What was the other uh, uh, transfer facility? Uh, you got, I know it was Middleton and Gurney. Gurney, yeah. so I went through Gurney. So I get to Gurney. And uh, I get in a scuffle, you know yeah, what I mean? My mouth is fly. Yeah. I get into it with the dude, you know what I mean? I end up whooping the dude. So You so, went to Gurney, so and 6'4 was down there. down there. That's my home girl. She worked down there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah let's, let's get to it, nigga. Yes. Yeah, yes. real yes. street yes. talk yes. around it. Stallion. <laughs> you, you hear me? I'm talking about. Yeah. Oh, yeah. boy. Yeah, you, yeah, she you, was you, married to uh, Rambo. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, heard, I, I heard not, stories yeah, about yeah, that. Six was, yeah, 6'4 was, yeah, she was yeah, doing her thing down there. But that's sure. a, that was good eye candy when you locked up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at it, he, he remember. Hey, boy, I tell him I say, you shot me back right there. <laughs> yeah, he he remember. I be tripping. That's why yeah. it's so crazy, man. Yeah. I might say it. <laughs> yeah. But I definitely, uh, I, re, I yeah, 6'4, she, she was one of those ones. Matter of yeah. fact, she's uh, Nene's, uh, uh, Aunt, the Trey's mama. Uh-huh. That's her, one of her best friends. Okay. So she she lived in March, but she would work in, uh, down there in Gurney. Yeah, yeah, that's. Yeah. Confusing. So that's how, yeah. So yeah. <laughs> it's a you small know, world. My, my daughter actually a prison guard right now. Oh, really? Yeah, at a woman's yeah. prison. At a woman's prison okay. down in Austin. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Okay. So yeah, yeah. That, that, that's something that I tell her to treat those people right. I say, you got some bad ones, but there's some good people in there too. Yeah. I say, you know, you just never know, man, who you're going to be dealing with or. You know, or what they might have been even in there for if they of color, to be honest with you. A lot of them be wrongfully accused. I've had some lawyers and stuff on here now that really show mm -hmm. you that there's a lot of people that don't do certain things and get caught up right. and they forced it on them. Especially in those times where you talking about right yeah, there. Yeah. Them times right there, we hot. I could just say it like this. How'd you feel when you were in that courtroom? It don't look like it was supposed to be there for you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You know, nah, like you belong. Honestly, they, I mean, at 18, they didn't give me no choice. My first, my only option was penitentiary. They didn't try to give me no probation. See? Now, if you'd have been another, uh, look of another race, yeah. uh, I guarantee you, you wouldn't even, probably even went to jail. Yeah. It, it, and and I, talk, I got friends that talk about this yeah. that are, are of the other race, to be honest with you. Like, I didn't, they'd have never took us for that. You remember that lady mm -hmm. always, I got stopped sometime with DWI. Nobody never took me to jail for that. I'm like, damn. Yeah, yeah it's, real. Get, it's a different. It's, it's definitely a privileged thing, yeah. you know. So you get down there, you do your time, you come back home. What is uh, two, one? Two. He's two. Two. Yeah, yeah, he right at he right at two. So mm -hmm. he 
when I I remember like yesterday, I come home, I come to her granny house, they out outside, you know, they got a huge family. Yeah. It's a lot of cousins and they all around the same age. It's a lot of them. So he out there, he had Nikki and all that old stuff, her along. Yeah, good you enough. Know what I'm he always liked that with her and her along, whatever doing him. And I'm just shaking my head, you know, because you got him doing him, but you got Paco. You know, Paco, he, he you know, he been the baby. You know, my daddy, daddy's baby. You know, yeah. everybody's baby, really. But anyway, what he was doing him, and I seen then, like, I got to get him. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because I've been taught better. Because Paco ran up and hugged him, Dad. And what he like, what's up, boo? Had <laughs> <laughs> to. Wow. A regular hey, two-year-old would have ran to you. He been live. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk.